Hello, my name is Grant McNary. I'm with Bushel and Basket. Today I'm going to show you how to do a pH test on your soil. I have right here a electronic soil tester. It's by Ferry and Morris the Seed Company. What you have to do is you have to first come down here, take off the two top, two inches of the top layer, then you need to mix it up, the soil, really good. And you need to get it wet to where it's kind of a muddy consistency. I've already done that already. There's two settings on here. There's a pH setting and there's a fertilizer analyzing setting. And what we're going to do first is the pH setting. So I've got that on there. I'm going to set it in here. And I'm going to wait for a minute just to see uh, how high it goes. Uh, currently it's at a pH of 7. But we got to again give it about a minute to uh, see what level it goes up to. Right here, I'm going to go ahead and put a blueberry plant. Last year, I had a blueberry plant that died, so I'll uh, also give you a, a chance to see how to uh, plant the blueberry bush. What we're looking for is a pH level of five and a half to about seven for a blueberry. They like acidity soil. Right now, uh, we started off at seven. We're currently at uh, just above six and a half. And we've got a couple more seconds before that goes. So what I'm testing for today is, like I say, the pH level, just to know whether or not the uh, soil is appropriate for the uh, blueberries. And I'm also going to test for uh, how much uh, fertility is in the soil. And the reason I'm going to do that today, if uh, I need more fertility, which I think I'm going to, I'm going to go ahead and uh, put some fertilizer down for the soil. So it's been about a minute, and currently the setting, if you want to take a look at that and show them there, it's just above six and a half. Okay, so that's the setting. So now I'm going to go ahead and pull this out. So we know the acidity, the pH level is perfect for the uh, uh, blueberries. We've got to go over here and clean this off. It comes with a little pad right here. So after you're done with the test, you need to clean off it, the pads again. So the probes have been clean. I'm now going to take it to the fertilizer section of it, down with the bottom. So this isn't going to take as long. Again, we put it right back in. And actually right now, give it five seconds. And it's actually at the low end. It's uh, We've got too little, and then you have ideal, and then you have too much. And uh, actually, we are going to need to put some more fertilizer. It would still work, but it's at the low end. So, anyways, that's how you're going to take and uh, use the soil tester. Uh, I recommend you test your soil when you uh, get ready to plant to make sure that your plant is suitable for the soil. This is Grant McNair with Bush on the Basket. Thank you very much.